Okay guys and welcome back to another student questions answered and this one's from Pascal. Now what Pascal wants is he wants to have a workbook like this one just here uh, with a button and when you hit the button a little input box will pop up and the user will type something to search for. Now when they hit OK what we want to do is go to another sheet that could have multiple tabs and here we have butchers, bakers and candlestick makers but you can have as many tabs as you want uh, and search for the value that the user just entered. So uh, let's have a look at the code how you do that. Oh sorry before I move on there are two files to download from this lecture SQA Pascal dataset and that's this butchers makers candlestick makers file and this one the Pascal run me from here and you'll find sheet one and also the code in here. So just paste that into a regular module and you'll be able to see this in operation for yourself. Okay, so I'm just going to minimize that and rejig these a little bit so we can see everything and here we go. Right, this is the code, it's called sub find me. Uh, now what I've done is I've set up a couple of variables at the top. My search is just going to hold the value from the user's uh, input of the input box and x is a simple counter that we're going to come to down here. So let's step through this. So f8 my search equals input box please enter a value be below. So uh, let's pick Tarek for uh, Tarek. Enter. So now we're going to activate SQA Pascal dataset. That's this file over here. So F8. That's activated. Range A1 select. Possibly not necessary, but I always like to start from range A1. Now this is where our loop comes in. What we're going to do is we're going to loop from one to the number of sheets in this workbook. So it doesn't matter if we have a thousand sheets in this workbook, this will iterate through them all. So here's our four and here's our next. Now because if we can't find a value, a match on the first sheet, we're going to get an error that would cause our code to stop. So what we're going to do is we're going to force continuation by saying on error, resume next. Don't worry, we have a way to check to see if we've found a match a little later on. So on error, resume next. Select the sheet by its index number. So as we're in our first pass through this loop, x is 1, so therefore on the first iteration we are looking at the first sheet, butchers. Now this is just copied straight out of a, a control and f find recorded macro. The only difference is I've replaced the value that would have been in here with my search, which is a string we've just captured. So F8 step through and you can see there that we have found Tarek on the first sheet. Now here's that test I was talking about. What we're going to do is we're going to use an in string function to see if the value of my search Tarek is found within the active cell value. So the in string search for that value inside of that value. So it doesn't have to be a complete match, it just needs to find whatever's in here somewhere in the active cell value. VB text compare means it's case insensitive. So if I have found a match then end. F8 end and we're done. Okay so that's how it works if it finds a match on the first sheet. Uh, I actually know the names on the other sheet so let's step through that and let's say Covent and trust me this is going to work so I'm just going to step through now we're on sheet one are we going to find it here we're not going to find it so we're going to move down to our next X loop through and then we're going to go to our next iteration which is number two Bakers can we find it in Bakers no we can't loop through next X candlestick makers and from there we can find the Covent Garden Candle Company I have found a match, therefore end. Now, that works perfectly as long as a match is found somewhere in there. But what we need to do is do something if it gets past this point and it hasn't found a match. And that's going to be straightforward. It's just a message box. Sorry, my search, uh, that's the value of my search, was not found in any sheet. VB OK only, no match. So let's just run that and search for something that's not in there. So let's search for Jarvis. And there you go, it went through butchers, bakers, candlestick makers, and it could not find a match. So no match, sorry, Jarvis was not found in any sheet. Okay, and then the code finishes. Okay, I hope that helps. As always, if you have any questions, just drop me a note and I'll be happy to help. Have a great day. Thanks very much.